on today, I'm going to be reading the 10x rule. I can subscribe. <clears throat> 18. Determine and take the right approach. The successful know that they can quantify what works and what doesn't work, whereas the unsuccessful focus solely on hard work. The right approach may be to institute a public relations program that softens the market, provide consumers with the right tool, or compel management to make the most powerful connections, find the best first investors, or hire the highest quality staff. Whatever the method may be, the successful don't think in terms of hard work, even though they are, of course, willing to work hard. Instead, they figure out how to work smart and handle the situation by finding and using the right approach until they succeed. The unsuccessful always find work to be difficult because they never take enough time to improve their approach or make it easier on themselves. The first three years of my life as a salesperson was hard work and gave me sporadic results at best. Then I committed two years and thousands of dollars to improving my approach, and selling was no longer work. Successful people invest time, energy, and money in improving themselves. As a result, they don't focus on how hard the work is, but rather on how rewarding the results are. When you're winning because you have perfected your approach, it won't feel like work. It will feel like success. And nothing tastes as good as the victory of success. So, you have to, you have to be improving yourself so that it's easier. And so, well, so successful people, like, they find what works and what doesn't, and they do what works. But unsuccessful people are just focused on hard work. So if you want to be successful, you have to also focus on what works. What makes it easier? So Kopi Soup is a book run by me about a guy named Bob and who he found a delicious soup to eat. When he discovered the ingredients, he was shocked. An Alien Stole My Homework is a book written by my brother about a kid named Ned and how he stopped aliens from stealing his homework. And I Say Kid is a book written by me and my brother about how kids can help their parents in their business. And these books are on Amazon. You can buy them there. Okay, I hope you like that. If you did, please like and subscribe. Bye.